Is the bellwether voler the future of personal air travel, or is it just a flashy concept that will never take off? Today, we'll explore the groundbreaking innovations in urban mobility that the Voler brings to the table. What could this mean for our daily commutes and the way we navigate our cities? Let's dive in and discover what makes the Voler so intriguing. The idea of personal air travel has fascinated us for decades, but Bellwether Industries might just be the company to bring it closer to reality. Their futuristic Voler concept, a compact EV tall vehicle, promises to reshape urban travel, offering city dwellers a personal flying machine. But is it practical? The Voler is a vision of simplicity and elegance. Designed without wings or visible propellers, it has a compact, sports car-like appearance that's meant to blend with the city skyline. The newest Voler model, the Oryx, can seat three passengers, with Bellwether aiming for both comfort and stability in dense urban settings. This third-generation model, showcased at the 2023 Dubai Air Show, promises a 50-mile range on a single charge, reaching destinations in under 20 minutes. Impressive numbers for city commutes. To push Voler's propulsion capabilities, Bellwether has partnered with Schubeler Technologies, a leader in electric propulsion based in Germany. Schubeler has already contributed to Bellwether's prototype development with its advanced electric ducted fan, the EP05-21. This fan is designed for efficiency, offering high performance while minimizing noise, a vital feature for urban environments. Bellwether hasn't shared the specifics of the propulsion system yet, but they're aiming for a cruise speed of 135 miles per hour and a range of 200 to 300 miles. Schubler's founder, Daniel Schubler, emphasizes that Bellwether's strategic presence in regions ready to embrace aerial mobility gives them a competitive edge. Dubai's the ideal spot for Bellwether to bring their flying car dreams to life. They've been testing flights there since 2021, seeing how the Oryx handles urban landscapes. At the Dubai Air Show, Bellwether showed off the Oryx with its new cognitive flight control system, which makes flying easier and more intuitive. The Oryx also comes with an adaptive electric propulsion system, crafted by Bellwether's own Bellwether Advanced Mobility Solutions, based out of the UK and Taiwan. Expanding offices into the Middle East lets Bellwether tap into the region's tech-forward vibe. The Voler's design leans toward the luxury side, feeling more like a flying sports car than your average commuter ride. While there's no official price yet, its sleek design and advanced tech suggest it'll cater to a wealthy crowd. Bellwether sees a future where air travel is for everyone, though, predicting that in the next decade, sky commuting could become the norm. Bellwether isn't alone in the race. Major players like Joby and Archer are also developing EV tolls, though they're aiming more at ride-sharing with companies like Uber. Bellwether's going a different route, targeting personal ownership and positioning itself as the Tesla of the skies. With its unique propulsion and compact city-friendly design, Voler could carve out its own niche. But going head-to-head -head with established giants won't be easy. Getting the green light for public use and building infrastructure are huge hurdles. Bellwether hopes to gain European certification by 2028, but creating the necessary support systems like Vertiports will need major funding. Public trust is key too, as safety standards and city adaptations have to be in place for EV tolls like Voler to fit into everyday life. What do you think? Will the Bellwether Voler truly revolutionize personal air travel, or is it just another ambitious dream? Share your thoughts in the comments below. 